we can incite a story either causally or coincidentally. Causal incitement has two flavors. One is particle, which means a direct targeted movement of energy from one to another intentionally. And then there's wave function. And that's sort of like witnesses of particle movement. So Struthers is a wave function causal. That's what causes him to go to the police station. And the last one, coincidental, we call that emergent. And it's emergent because it's coming from the environment itself. So a coincidental inciting incident could be a rainstorm or a tornado or the wind blowing over something. So it's coincidental is sort of a chaotic random event that emerges from the environment, whereas causal has two flavors, particle or wave. With this new definition, what would you call the inciting incident of eyewitness? Causal wave. Correct. Okay, no, that makes sense. But you can backtrack to the particle. So the original particle is off the page. So we're just going to clarify what's on the page. And that's a wave function of the energy transfer that Struthers is walking in with. A couple of months ago, Leslie and Danielle and I were talking about the five senses and how your senses have sort of uh, distance functionality. So you can see things much further than you can smell them or hear them. When we're talking about wave functionality, a lot of wave functionality can be expressed to the single audience member that the author is signaling to using sensory mechanisms such that she can anticipate the wave hitting, eventually reaching her. 